Before I call up our phenomenal executive director for IHPC, Susan Hager, who I asked to take an interim role two or three years ago. <laughs> She's done a wonderful job. So what you've heard today, you've heard several words, and this is just an introduction. It's very exciting that this caucus will be ongoing, that we're planning uh, the potential of other briefings more in depth about various uh, clinical topics, environmental topics, advocacy and policy topics. You've heard about integrative health. Please remember integrative health is the best of conventional and other, not necessarily alternative, but other ways to look at illness as well as health and healthcare. You've heard about a team approach, takes a village. Well, the team approach is very important. I'm gonna be audacious to say, and I think I can as an MD, it's not about a hierarchy. It's not about a hierarchy. It's about people coming with humility, with their different disciplines, and bringing the best that they have to the patient in a very equal and pluralistic fashion. It's also about the opioid crisis. And again, it's not about the opioid crisis. We are having an epidemic of people that are suffering, that have lost their way in the journey of life. They have pain and they have emotional suffering. That is what we should focus on. Of course, the opioid situation, overuse, abuse, has heightened this because people are dying of it. We have to focus on this, but we need to remember, in order to achieve three words for our healthcare system, we need to approach this as the pain crisis, not just the opioid crisis. Those three words that I would like to ask you to focus on Guide your visions, pray on, is a healthcare system in the United States based on prevention, wellness, and well-being. Thank you. Susan.